So, back to yoga. Hope I'm in frame here. Uh, Ashtanga yoga. It had eight limbs to it. We've done the yamas, which are your external morals. We're gonna do some niyama today, which is uh, your view on the self, the lasana, the exercises, pranayama, control over the breath, pratyahara, withdrawal from the uh, external distractions, dharana, Focusing in your concentration and Dhyana meditation and uh, Samadhi enlightenment bliss So we did all the uh, five yamas in some other videos and now we'll move into the niyamas which are uh, your The morals of yourself the yamas were more of a general morals to hold for all things, including yourself. The niyamas focus a little more on things you can keep in mind that you should need to take care of yourself with. There's five of them too, I think. Yes, there's five of them also. So, there's saucha. Just purity or cleanliness, clarity. Uh, santosha is contentment. Tapa is, is um, your uh, austerity and discipline. Uh, sav, excuse me. Savhayaya. I'm not quite sure pronouncing in that one, but it's a self study or educating yourself in things and then Ishvara pran, Pranid Pranidhana <laughs> and that is more of a study of the woo, the spiritual or occult or uh, more of a study of the um, non-book things or it's, it's also also considered a surrendering or an offering but we'll We'll get into Ishvara uh, Pranidhana <laughs> later. Today we are going to do um, Saucha, which is purity or cleanliness. And so Saucha, Saucha is about keeping yourself clean, say, and taking a bath here and there. So that it cleans the external body, gets rid of dirt and grime. So. That is the simple part of Saucha, is keeping yourself clean. It also has to do with the more internal parts, and that's like Saucha is telling us to keep up with our asana, to keep our body toned and healthy, and to do pranayama, to keep our lungs pure and healthy, and blood flows easily through the body. It also goes into um, make sure you're consuming pure things. Back to the whole food thing, and it's kind of um, uh, himsha also with the non-harming, but it looks more towards only yourself. So clean your body externally and internally. Make sure you're eating pure things, and then it also has to do with the mind. And saucha and um, trying to keep your mind pure is more of controlling your emotions or ridding yourself of the emotions of hatred, uh, anger, greed, jealousy, uh, pride, delusions, and to learn that um, maybe they're not needed and you're not coming off as impure thoughts when you're having these emotions. Uh, also, uh, other aspect of um, Saucha is speaking clearly. Of course, maybe I didn't speak very clearly when I was going through the eight limbs because I uh, went blank on a few of them. But 
It means speak clearly, like, get your intention out in a clear way so that the others can understand you. It's, um, it's not saying be short and yes, no, and that's it. It's not, and I'm not saying, uh, leave out detail, but much, much like, um, much like writing, it's, you only write what you need to write to get, convey the message. Using all these adjectives and, uh, he spoke loudly, well, maybe you should have wrote in the sentence before that, that would make the person think that they were speaking loudly, and then you wouldn't need that adjective. Little example of speaking clearly, but use that in speech also. So, saucha, purity of both the external body with keeping ourselves showered here and there, the internal body with exercise and knowing that you can control your breath, Meditation helps with purifying the mind and body also. Also being aware that uh, you can control your emotions. These bad emotions like hatred and greed and delusions you have. Get rid of them. Uh, and eating pure food. Sauch is, Sauch is not a very difficult one. And soon we'll be done with all these morals and rules. Rules. Oh, I'd like to read a quote, actually. From the Light on Yoga. Sorry. I skip back to Niyama. I like the, what he said. Or it gives a good definition of Niyama. It's a... Uh, and I quote. <laughs> rules of conduct that apply to individual disciplines. That's Niyama. And Saucho was the first one we went to. Purity. Namaste. Speak clearly.